Demonstrators marched for a second night of peaceful protests in El Cajon, California. The fatal shooting of 38-year-old Alfred Olongo on Tuesday prompted outrage from residents who said the incident is the latest example of police violence against black men. As protesters gathered for the start of the march, a Donald Trump supporter in a Make America Great Again hat began taunting the crowds. Eventually, he was chased away. Protesters said their ability to cope with the continued fatal police shootings of black men is reaching a fever pitch. We've been trying to come, with, come up with peace, peaceful solutions to this. It's, it's like terrorist acts on the black community, and we're tired of it. We're tired of being tired. Yeah, these are human beings, and they're being killed. I mean, like, this is something that everyone should be doing right now. Everyone out there, like, come on, stand up, say something. The shooting happened near a strip mall in El Cajon. Police said they were responding to a call about a man walking in and out of traffic. When they arrived on the scene, they asked Olongo to put his arms up, but police said he drew something from his pocket and pointed it at them. At that time, officers opened fire with both a gun and a taser stun gun. Police would not confirm what Olongo was holding, but said there was no weapon recovered at the scene. 